It is the first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Who will experience liftoff in the opener? And it's live right here on EA TV. Good evening and welcome to Alcor, welcome to the Al Bayt Stadium, the venue for this one. I'm Derek Ray and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. And it is a first test for these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's France and they take on Australia. Well, I'm looking forward to this one, Derek. It's so important that you get off to a good start. So let's hope both sides go for the win here and we get an exciting match. This is the goalkeeper, Rafael Varane plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. And Goro Conte starts alongside Paul Pogba in central midfield. And up front, Karim Benzema plays alongside Kylian Mbappe. Coman on the offensive. Benzema. No, high quality defending and space for them here on the flank he's in with a chance and a goalkeeper on top of his game well it's great goalkeeping what a big save that is Over it comes. Well, far from the ideal header. And the goalkeeper had it all the way. Good movement. Determined defending. And there the move will end because it's offside. Close, though. Conte. Now Griezmann. Mbappe. A real opening now. Expert piece of finishing from Benzema. Well, let's take another look at this pass from Mbappe. He has so much vision, and this is Benzema at his best. He's composed, he shows great technique, and he just smashes it beyond the goalkeeper. It's a brilliant goal. Goal 1-0 then. For France. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Coman. Benzema. Here's Mbappe. And return to Benzema. Terrific block. And the right place to cut out the pass. Coman. Benzema. Now he must favour the cross. Mbappe. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Gives it a go. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Coman. 
Conte. Jules Kunde on the ball. Paul Pogba. Promising move this from France. Making sure it didn't get past him. Well, an opportunity for France to add to their lead from this corner. Played in by Griezmann. Well, not cleared away completely. And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area, but I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. Goal. 2-0 now, and back on the way. France. Boyle. A bit of running room now on the wing. And whipped into the box. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. Yep. Played over. to take on the shot tremendous block he could pick out a teammate fantastic work to thwart the danger it's still alive well it could have been but for the offside flag well France have controlled possession as you can see and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly their pressing has been excellent and they just haven't stopped working it's been a fantastic performance up to now Indeed, perhaps they can cash in again. Let's see. Well, not the greatest pass. Easily intercepted. Benzema. Oh, a good diving save. And over comes the corner. He's got thinking time here. And it goes! A three-goal cushion, and you truly sense it's a matter of how many. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner, but the keeper should do better at his near post. That's gone in far too easily. That's not good goalkeeping. And the action underway once more, with France very much on top. And he's broken free! And nicely parried away. Well, the keeper deserves a lot of credit. That was a fine save, wasn't it? Benzema. Oh, he fancies his chances. Throw in for France coming up. Coman. A routine save. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Jamie McLaren and Irvin on the ball and the whistle is sounded for half time in this game well we're focusing on him for a reason he's playing with real authority and attack Stuart well the keeper will be sick at the sight of him he's been shooting from everywhere and he's taking his goals really well
the ball rolling again France having already made a big first half statement here well we see more dazzling football from them in this second half long distance effort keeper did his job No worries for the keeper. A really intense pressure applied. to get tighter and played in and collected tidily he had plenty to think about and France finding space on the flank cross could be useful but at one point on its flight I wondered if the keeper would have difficulties but no problems in the end Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Mbappe. Now with Benzema. A smart stop here. Played in by Griezmann. Another corner. Well, here it is again, and you have to say it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Running room in the wide position. Can he find the net? An easy one for Loris. And the keeper there to deal with it. Remarkable save. Yes, again. Inspirational. Well, he's given us away. Jackson Irvin. A bit of running room now on the wing. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. And cuts inside. France with the ball again. And he takes on the shot. You'll be hard-pressed to find a better save than that. Loris. Now, how about the short corner? It's a nice-looking ball. A terrific defending to stop them progressing. Can they hit on the break? Oh, in with a chance. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. And they have possession again. Real chance. And there it is. A goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best.
Well, let's take another look. And you have to say the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there. Defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4 1. Oh, it might be. Oh, that was begging to be put home, but the goalkeeper has it. Rustic. Goodwin. And given away. Five minutes to go. Fine ball from Antoine Griezmann. And keeping it out. So a personnel change then. Griezmann tasked with taking the corner. Not all that convincing defensively. And a time for cool heads. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. A real opening now. And a decent save. Full credit. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Current scoreline 4 2. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have three extra minutes. What a shocking pass, really. Well, there it is, the final whistle, and France have prevailed in this one. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, Derek, they were better than their opponents in all aspects of the game. They defended well enough, they dominated midfield, and they created chances as well. It was a great performance. Well, this man has given us plenty of reasons to dwell on his performance, hasn't he, Stuart? Well, I have to say, that was impressive. Not just his goals, but his all-round play. He was excellent. 